Uh, endometriosis is a, a disorder where the lining of the uterus, the endometrium, is found outside of the uterus. For teenagers, the most common spots are uh, ligaments and pelvic tissues between the uterus and the intestine. Uh, there you can have a suspicion that an adolescent has endometriosis, but the only way to tell if you really have endometriosis is to do a procedure called a laparoscopy. That's when you go to the upper room, make a little tiny cut in your belly button, and put a telescope in to look at the uterus, ovaries, and the remainder of the pelvic tissue to see whether there's endometriosis there. If there is endometriosis, usually excising it or removing um, the endometriosis tissue can help a pelvic pain, and many studies have shown um, that can preserve your future fertility. But it is important to know that um, not everyone who has painful periods is going to have to have surgery. That there are many treatments that we use beforehand to try and decide who needs surgery to evaluate their pain and who can get treated with um, medicines that can decrease inflammation and help with that monthly pain. For instance, there is an idea that we use all the time called medical uses of birth control pills. That's using the hormones in birth control pills to decrease the thickness of the lining of the uterus, and that tends to make menstrual periods shorter, lighter, less heavy, less painful. So that's a common first intervention that we use when, when menstrual pain gets out of control. Sometimes we're nervous to talk to our doctors about the pain that we're having. We're afraid that we'll have to take medicine all the time or we'll have to do a procedure. But if you are having monthly pain with your periods, there's, it's a good reason to come in and speak with your doctor to figure out what's going on. Um, moms, friends may tell you it's normal, but again, if you're missing school and you're using a lot of medicine to deal with the pain, it's a good reason to be seen.